Hello everyone and welcome to the Mathman YouTube channel. In this video today we are going to be multiplying fractions. More specifically we are going to be multiplying whole numbers by fractions and we're going to be working through three different examples. But before we get going please help out this channel by liking this video as it helps it to reach more students across the world and if you do know someone who this video would benefit then please feel free to share it with them. But without further ado, let's get going. So we're going to be doing 9 multiplied by 1 third. Now, the magic trick of multiplying fractions is when you have a whole number, we're going to convert it into an improper fraction. So 9 as an improper fraction is going to be 9 over 1. So it's 9 whole ones. And then all we do is we multiply it by 1 third and then the rest is easy because all you do is 9 multiplied by 1 is 9 and then 3 times uh, 1 times by 3 sorry multiply the denominators together that makes 3 and we're left with an improper fraction but that's not the end of the question because um, when you're asked to multiply fractions you have to give your answer as a mixed number so to work out what nine th uh, thirds is as a mixed number, I just say how many threes in nine? There are three. And so the answer for this one is three holes or three. Looking at this next one then, so we have 24 multiplied by a quarter. So I'm gonna change the 24 into an improper fraction, 24 over one. Then I'm gonna multiply it by a quarter so 24 times 1 is 24, 1 times 4 is 4. So I've got my improper fraction final answer, but now I need to work it out as a mixed number. How many 4s are in 24? There are 6, 6 whole ones. And that's the final answer. Now this one's a little bit trickier because it should have a whole number answer, and it should also have a remainder. So I'll show you what to do with that. So we've got 17 multiplied by 1 fifth. So I'm going to change the 17 into an improper fraction. 17 over, over 1. Then I'm going to multiply it by 1 fifth. 17 times by 1 equals 17. And then 1 times 5 is 5. And then if I want to convert that into a mixed number, I say how many fives in 17? There's three fives in 17, and there is two remainder. That two remainder is going to make up our numerator for the fraction, and the five denominator, we put that at the bottom. So um, the final answer is three whole ones and two fifths. So 17 multiplied by 1 fifth is 3 whole ones and 2 fifths. I hope this video was useful for you. If you did like it, then please, again, don't forget to like the video and share it with someone uh, to help them too. Thanks very much for watching, and I'll see you in the next Mathsman video.